I've had another idea for showing off the plotter function of the Python editor Mu using it with the BBC micro bit. Um, originally, um, it was demonstrated by Nicholas Tolovey and uh, Lee Morfried at Adafruit that you could use this function to uh, show live plots of the accelerometer readings from the micro bit itself. Um, I then had the idea of taking it a little bit further and having a remote micro bit that would broadcast wireless data over radio so that you could attach a sensor to some moving object and have it move around so it wasn't tethered to the computer. And then Paul Knighton has been doing some amazing work uh, attaching things like pulse sensors and uh, sound sensors uh, to the micro bit and plotting that in real time as well, particularly like the pulse sensor. I think that's an amazing idea. I can't wait to try that out for myself. I think it would make an excellent classroom activity where you could uh, do all sorts of cross-curricular things with um, uh, with biology and all sorts of things it's, and data handling. It's an amazing, amazing idea. Um, I've suddenly occurred to me, I've got some micro bit sensors lying around. I've got a Monk Makes sensor board here, uh, which has got three sensors built into it. It's got a sound sensor and it's got a temperature sensor and a light sensor all on one board. And you can connect all three up to the micro bit just using some jumper wires. I thought, well, why not? have a go at taking some live readings from that and seeing if we can plot them in Mu. And so that's what I've done. So this Python code here is just a few lines. It takes readings from each of the pins. So pin zero has got the sound sensor connected to it. Pin one has got the temperature sensor and pin two has got the light sensor connected to it. I've just done a little bit of fiddling around with some numbers here just to make the numbers scale a bit better so we can see differences, but you could uh, do some better maths with that to get more accurate readings. Now, if I go into the REPL here, I'll click on the REPL and I'll flash that code to the micro bit. We should see it flashing on the back. We should see the LED flashing. So that, that code is going onto the micro bit. And we should start to see over here, now we've got three readings. So we've got sound, temperature and light as three numbers coming in here. If I now call up the plotter, we should see, there we go, I'll just make that a little bit bigger so we can see the plotter. So the blue line is the sound sensor and you can see that kind of goes with my voice. And if I clap, there we go. We should see some uh, fairly big events happening there. Uh, the temperature sensor is here. So that's the green line. If I put my finger on it, you should see the temperature rising. If I blow on it, you should see it falling. And the orange line, well, the orange line is the light sensor. So if I cover that over with my finger, you should see that drops down lower. If I put um, a light source on it, like a torch from an old phone, let me get that, shine that on it. We should, I hope, see, we'll get it right on there. There we go, we can see the light going up and going down as I take the torch away. So very simple idea again. If I just bring this back down here, you can see just a few lines of Python, you know, half a dozen or so uh, lines of Python in order to get some live data readings that you can visualize on screen. In this case, using three sensors built into one board. This is the Monk Makes sensor board for Microbit. Super easy to use. And uh, another example of how great the plotter is in Mu.